Hello everyone and welcome to the Reapers. Today something very special. We're doing Seitao. We're looking at our latest Seitao match. Say hello my four boys that are in our Seitao team. Hi guys. Hello. Hello. We're going to watch the match that they just did. Before that, the first thing I want to do, Mr. Bear, if that is your real name, is look at the league table because it makes it more exciting. This is before we've done this match. We are in the... So there's two leagues, isn't there, in Seitao. There's gold and diamond. Gold is four-man teams. Diamond is six-man teams. Is that right? That's 100% correct. Right. So what we've got here is the standings at the moment. We're third. We are the Grim Reapers. Our main plane is a Viper. We've got nine points. Ahead of us are Tor, Tactical Air Warfare, Wolfpack, and German Air... Oh, it's typical the Germans are all up there. A German Air uh, Tactical Air Group. They're like, we shall practice five times <laughs> per day and not and nothing else matters. <laughs> <laughs> um, why are we only third bear team leader of GR? Um, for stars cap, we can't really see it, but... Uh, no problem, not ours. <laughs> it's a league. We all play eight games together. Uh, we've only played three. So the team on top have played four. Uh -huh. Some have played six and five. Uh, come the second, third of January 2021... We'll all have played eight, and then it goes into the playoffs. Right. So, interestingly, at, at the end of this match, we would have played four. We could actually be drawing with Tor Wolfpack, in, maybe not in kill-death ratios, but in points. Is that correct or not correct? That would be 100% correct. <laughs> Holy pajama pants. Right. That really spices things up, value viewers. Right. Um, also, for in case it's the first time of anyone watching, 30 seconds on bear of what how the match works, please. We take off from opposite runways. There is a combat zone in the center, a bubble if you want to call it, where we fight against each other. The last person standing has to fly back to the base and RTB land at the base to win the round. Roger, okay, so yeah. it's a straight So you team. only need... Mm -hmm. Go ahead. You only need one uh, of your members to survive and land to win the round. That's that's just a specification there. Okay. Well, we're going to fast forward to the takeoff. Um, on our group, we've got the usuals: Squiddle, Signore, Bear, and later on, all in F-16s. Yes, F-16s. Um, give us a quick spiel about why you like the F-16s, guys. Data link. Data. Yeah, Hornet's got data link. Sexy. Ah, <laughs> there we go. Uh, ba basically, the uh, the F-16 is. It's fast, but it's not the fastest. You know, like I think the F-15 is probably the fastest at high altitude. Mm -hmm. uh, it's got decent loadout, six AMRAMs, uh, and it's got data link. So it's kind of like a mixture between, a, well, it's kind of like a mix between a Hornet and an F-15, but with less weapons. So um, I guess that's the best way to put it. And you feel like a little more thrust, a little more speed, a little more agility on the 16 than the yeah. Hornet, I think. That, that high I like speed the F-18, sure. though. Miranda's back. Miranda. Oh, hello there, uh, sir. Nice to meet you. I'm in my bed. I'm in my bed right now. You're in your bed. Oh, he's he's weeping. <laughs> Why are you How in your you bed, first? Miranda? Okay, he's gone again. Um, <laughs> let's talk about PTF. Who were they? How have we played them before? We played them twice before. We in fact played them the last match too. Oh, okay. It's Phoenix Task Force. They're based, not really sure where they're based. Um, we played them in the first round, and we beat them. We played them in the last round, and we beat them. And then we played them again today. How come it works out that we keep playing the same guys? Is that normal? It's just yes. a bracket. So we, we, because it, there's um, leagues, or sorry, not leagues, there's... Uh, divisions within the league mm. uh so just like how in professional soccer you've got like the premier league and the mm. la liga and stuff like that right um they all play within their own division and then once they get out of division play then you go to your your you know your mm. inter-division play you know what i mean and so right now we're still in division play and uh so we have to play people in our team in our division multiple times and it just so happens that the schedule worked out that we've played them all three times uh and this is our third match roger very good they seem to be messing about does it take a long time shall i scroll it forward fast? yeah their f14 got lost of course it so did. they had to get someone to go to game master and direct him 
Oh, Jesus Christ. Well, I mean, look at him. He, he does have to navigate a maze for the runway. Was he at Spa 25? Yeah. German training going well there. That sounds it's it sounds um it sounds really harsh, but remember they can't see themselves on F ten, bear in mind. Yeah. So you've got to literally know where all these taxiways are. So. Well I will say yeah, for that anyone, is you do have knee boards. Everyone has a knee board with the runway diagrams, so if can I ask a quick question about the loadouts and stuff before you Go start? ahead. Go ahead, yep, send. Uh is it always I have but few of these, uh, I have seen that there is uh, restrictions on amount of weapons because, uh, you know, if you take an F-18, you can have uh, eight AMRAMs and two sidewalks or so. Uh, so yeah, six, six AMRAMs is the absolute limit for any plane uh, that can carry AMRAMs. So if you have the F-18, you can only take six, yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. But but they can also take as many of the other missiles, so they could take a four aim of six aim nines uh, with their six am rams. Consequently, the X-rays. Consequently, no, in the sixteens, we just take six am rams. We don't even take sidewinders. <laughs> So let's skip forward some time. Right, closing together, just skipping some time. Now, GR are keeping their typical um, formation, and the blues are a bit all over the place, but fine, that's just how they're going to fly. Let's check. Uh, kinematics angels 33 and a half and 570 knots blues wow 750 knots for the f15 36 37,000 boom you guys hear me yeah we're yep. back now we're back in business i managed to accidentally delete the server nice <laughs> thanks, thanks for deleting the server <laughs> No, 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 not you. I mean, like, not the Discord. I mean, myself. I removed myself from the server. Well. Oh. Yeah, someone give me tags back. Doing. I lost all my tags. Yeah. What? RC. Happened. Okay, uh, Blues are 30 miles from the zone. There's actually a small advantage from getting to getting to the Bulls first. You can kind of... It helps you posture and push the other side out of the bubble that we were talking about. So, they are 30 miles with their super fast F-15. We're 45 miles. Dude, the server just crushed. Miranda's back! Super Miranda! So is Miranda the name of the girl that left him, or is that yes. his name? Observer. Yes, ah. <laughs> and, and when he, Miranda said to me, Stop calling me Miranda, it reminds me of Miranda. And I said, It's your goddamn name! That's his name himself. That <laughs> Only Miranda could make a such Dude, a Dude, it's just fucking crushed. I don't... Well, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. It, just it is yeah. kind of cruel. You think, yeah. You think that's bad? I clicked leave server thinking it would leave the server and it completely <laughs> left the server. <laughs> oh my <laughs> god. <laughs> Cooler sent that out. That terrible. Out. Tell us about the rules for the M54, please, guys. Oh, M54 oh, uh, so, oh. There are two weapon sets. Go ahead, Squirtle. Alright, so in the A bracket, which or A weapon set, which we're doing now, you can use the. 47C variant, which has a better tracker, but the same motor as the 47A, uh, or yeah, Mark 47A, and then they also have access to the Mark 60, which is uh, a much longer burning motor. So, yeah, gives them extra range. Whenever 3,000 knots that missile did, mm -hmm. and yep. they can carry four of those on a Tomcat. Hard to dodge that, boys. Hard to dodge that. 
So Blues have done much better kind of tactically in that they've got closer to the bullseye. They are now 10 miles away. Reds are 40 miles away, but we'll see how it pans out. The problem is that F-15 has left all his buddies alone. That's the only problem with having mismatching aircraft. The F-15 is now 20 miles ahead of anything else. Um, uh, the Blues uh, are doing a left-right wingman split. Squirtle Signore, the two S's. Uh, Bear and Leighton heading down the south. Uh, F-15's getting sucked south. Looks like these guys are possibly getting sucked north. We shall see. Looks like they've dumped that M-54. I don't know how they did it. Or maybe they haven't. Yes, yes they have. They've dumped that M-54. Which is nice. So that is just ballistic now. Missiles out from Bear, 28 miles, and straight into a split S. Should be a very fast missile, so, yeah, sort of 1,800 knots there. Um, now, F-15 is all out on his own. Tactically, I'm not sure what he's trying to achieve. I'm going to be honest, I mean, he's very fast. He's 900 knots, but... Uh, for sure, he's trying to use his immense speed to get some long range cam ram shots off. Yeah, exactly. He's not going to do that for bags on like he does, but okay. I mean, yeah. he should have dropped he's going pretty fast. He's, I think he's going like Mach 1.6 right now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's got 900 knots almost. Okay, he's missed out. He's going to split S because he's got a missile coming to, and down he goes. Stump. Check check the speed on his missile. Let's see. Let's stand by. It is a two and a half thousand knots out. That yeah, is very fast. Yeah. That's <laughs> fast for. Almost. Yeah, that's going to hit Leighton right in the eye. It is. Let's see what's going up north. Uh, let me take all this crap off so we can actually see what's going on. Okay, Leighton's got a fast missile, 1,500 knots. But he's going to notch it. It's hard for that missile to hit him like that. But it's actually getting rather close, worryingly. And no, that's been... Oh, Leighton! Just... Look at that, Valley viewers. Good work, Leighton. That's nice. Well done. Missiles Fantastic. from uh, Anomaly. That's a dangerous missile on Signore there. And we all know Signore is an emotional man. Let's hope he doesn't get sucked into a fight here. Uh, Very emotional. 1,700 knots. <laughs> yeah, I had to console him. He was crying a lot. I mean, the it bullshit. was weeping. <laughs> 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 I'm just kidding. He didn't cry. Not today. <laughs> Not Paris. today. The other games, however... Paris is uh, really good shape by look at the lovely shape by the uh, reds. Bang, 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 bang. Lovely sh kind of like encapsulating shape. A bit like a um, a, a coronavirus, how it encapsulates uh, <laughs> oh. cells. No, I'm just saying. And then destroys them. them. Or does it? Mm, yeah, and then just eats the <laughs> or, does it, or does it inject itself because it's a virus yeah, and actually no, at... transcribe its own DNA look, into this? Look anyway. Big brain on Squiddle going on there. Par uh, Paris has gotten himself in all kinds of trouble. He's completely out of shape with his other three. Without mutual support, you're a dead man. But let's see. Woo! We, we were joking that the, the F 15 is kind of like a blind man with like a couple is. of M16s in his hands. Like. Yeah. <laughs> 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 he's, gonna, he's, gonna, got, yeah. he's got very bad SA, but good he's got no SA, there. has good, he really? Good speed and good weapons. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Oh my god, he stopped. He stopped him in there. Secret <laughs> tactic! Secret! He's unplugged his Ethernet cable to dodge the missile. Interesting. <laughs> oh, that gone. must be the guy. That Easy kill, that. boys. Yeah, Easy kill. Good. We'll take what we can get. It's a free kill for us. I yeah, sadly got. for them, but yes. Mm. All right. Mm -hmm. We'll take it. We'll take it. We'll take it. Absolutely. Definitely is pumping missile. Boom! That's a fast one. That is a viper. An aggressive viper. Look at that. Interesting skin. Yeah, they're, they're great. Oh my god. Yeah, the new ones they gave the new default skins are Cap, really predict good. The future here, and you might want to F two Signore. It's a sexy dodge here. Roger, I'm just watching. Yeah, I'm watching that uh, that big mother come. That's a big missile, boys. That is a big missile. I'm looking for Signore. Damn, oh, I've lost him. My apologies, Signore. Oh, it's okay. I just dove down. That's why I pulled mm. the lead downwards. That's all. Is it dove or dived? I'm never really sure. Um, I dove down. I or dived dive. down. I don't know. Dove sounds weird, doesn't it? Land and sea. Is that an American thing? I dove. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Dive I have no idea. <laughs> I like the tails, the Swede tail calls. Uh, according to Merriam-Webster, dived and dove are interchangeable. Yes. Mm, all right. Both <laughs> are good. Right. Well done. 
Huh. Right, so you've got them on the back foot now. Uh, it wasn't their fault. They got lagged out. It happens. Yes. Well, it's unfortunate, honest, but... I don't think he would have survived that long. It was an F-15 out on his own with no SA. He couldn't have done that. Oh, they were, they were, were too much up there. We're going to hit him. Roger, yeah, yeah, that's true. It's a maneuver kill to Roger. Squirtle and Leighton. Yeah, Senora and Leighton, I think. Look at this little guy, this little missile is chasing this guy. He's like, whoa. Oh, look at the deflection on those fins. That's so cool. Yeah, is that new? That's yeah, awesome. it's, yeah, it is. Yeah. That. Super Wags was working on it. That is a beautiful thing. Signore wow. is in for a kill. It's flanking deathly. That is 12 miles. Who's going to shoot first? Pow. You must look at your wings when you drop your tanks. It's fantastic. Hey, Cap, what what, what FPS are you streaming this thing? Because it gets really spotty when you look it's, at a lot of it's colors. Ter it's my terrible uh, i5. It's it, desperate. No, no, I think it's... it's 30 it's FPS is the answer. Uh, well... If it's your i5, it oh. might be. Dodges? Neutral dodges? I'm having the same issue, I think. It's just Discord. Like if yeah, you I have this problem on Discord as well. Yeah. yeah, it's just kind of... Yeah, it's Discord. I'm getting like three frames per second. Crazy Miranda. Yeah, oh, there's a Mark 60. Terrible. That's a Mark 60. That's a fast missile. <laughs> Look, they're just shooting each other over this mountain. It's quite cool. Yeah, it's, it's, it's lovely. It's lovely conservative, good play from both teams at the moment, especially with uh, Blues being a man down. They're holding their own. Cop, cop. Did you ever did a vigil in where you broke up there, Miranda? Where you can like um, use the aim nine sidewinder as an air to ground missile. Like it's a hit seeking missile, oh. though. But can you kind of? Uh, test it? You can't track. It can't track. Use as a ground. So ignore oh, it, you got so hit. It's gonna track I did. Uh, yeah. No, it can't. We tried it's it. Bad. I didn't. I, I lost the warning, oh, so I it thought I beat kill it. Shot. It wasn't even a kill shot. It was just like a medium ranged. Well, the warning was gone, so I turned back in. I flew up from my okay. low altitude, and then it. I heard the warning again, and it was too late. This guy's got himself target fixation. He's a dead man, and he knows it. There's nothing he can do to get out of that. Got himself into a gangbang situation. He did, didn't he? Good no, let's be real. If you're flying at a low altitude and you kind of choose the M9 sidewinder to be unarmed, and you're real flying at low altitude and you launch the missile and it points to something really hot, would well, that work? I couldn't kinda. get it to work. You can try, but I couldn't get it to work. I've tried it quite thoroughly. It works in real life, but in, yeah. I don't know if it's modeled in mm, the game. Definitely not. We did extensive testing. Okay, we've got a. Eight mile missile, that's an okay missile. Oh computer. shit. It's a Mark 60, that's great. Oh, in the face! At least it's, yeah. it's, it's, it's smoked. At least it's smoked. Yeah. That's gonna hurt someone. That's gonna hurt. Bear! Bear, that's gonna hurt! Oh my god! It, woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Did you see oh. that, boys? Jesus! <laughs> that was now, insane! That was a good notch. That was a good notch on Bear's part. Could have shown his back, but Anomaly is there to cover him. So, good work from the Blues here, they're getting better. There's no doubt about it. Oh yeah, that's so not one thing for sure is P PTF has gotten, Before. since our first match, they've gotten a lot better. Significantly, it's a different team. Yeah, they're really, really good. There's, there's no doubt, this is the hardest time of the three. Uh, did you guys get disconnected, like, yeah, like, I'd, I'd like, like to say I tactically happened. shot Roger two Miranda. missiles there because of the 14, but I just accidentally... Oh, yeah. Happens in the excitement. Right. Okay. Just chasing this guy down. It's two against one now. There's not much this guy can do against two. So we're just going to push him out of the circle, I imagine. Great match. Really, just a nice match, that was. All sorts yeah, of good stuff happening yeah. there. Just fixing my track IR quick. So Squirtle and Bear here have the a good advantage because they're chasing him, but they're higher than him. Roger. So they have a they have an energy advantage. Mm -hmm. Tactically, I'm dropping weight so I can get faster. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they say he's on a constant defensive. Very little they're strategy. closing though. Because I'm also desperately low on fuel. Mm -hmm. And they've got to get back to the base, haven't you? Yeah, 127. I think the guys. Is the guy turning hot? I think he is. Yes. Yep. 
he's getting getting a world of hurt here because he's only seven miles. It's nearly a kill shot. It might be a kill shot. Looks like it. If he doesn't evade, it's, it's in the face. He probably knows it's done now, I imagine. Boom, dead. Well done, boys. Ooh. Very good. Well, thousand pounds of fuel. Thousand pounds of fuel. Do you make it back? I do. Well done. Right, we're going to skip to the next round. Stand back. Sorry to interrupt again, but uh, uh, when we were starting the last round, I made a question about this 9X band and uh, uh, stream cut out. Oh, yes. It is banned, yes. You're not allowed to use it. It wouldn't be fair for the non-X uh, planes, would it? Because it's so good. It, it's real. It's just so maneuverable. I, I, even if we did have the 9X, I will say for the Probably F-15, wouldn't. we still wouldn't use it just because the AMRAM... We the the ranged weapons are a luxury mm. in this kind of when fight. you only have like six six pylons and, and an AMRAM is fairly capable in short range as long as you give lead. it sufficient lead. Yeah, so I am a little bit surprised that uh, not so many teams are using Tomcat with M fifty fours because it's really a long range weapon. It's long range, but it's very easy to defend at long range. So I mean, range is only a a piece of the pie, you know, because you, yeah, you can trash the missiles fairly easily, and the radar, and the also the the Tomcat. While it's very capable in pretty much all regimes of fighting, it's it starts to struggle and lose SA as it gets closer in. Uh, it's right. got an older data link system, and it just they just start to lose SA, and. Uh, and that's not good. And they don't they have a good. They don't have a good intermediate missile. Like a, mm -hmm. they yeah. don't have an Amram. They have either Phoenixes or M sevens, and those aren't good at four miles. As, uh, as I mean, a Sparrow might be a, probably not, especially it's if just they're so slow. Ranking. That's the problem. Yeah. <laughs> Sparrows. Yeah, the Sparrow is crappy. It's the crappiest box uh, gun in the game. I think. It just it has a slow motor. Yeah. You can almost outrun them while they're burning. Almost. Yeah. That's funny. So yeah, the the Tomcat it almost like kind of turns into like a fifteen with that with its SA problem when it gets close. Hmm. Hey, for a while it was popular to have a Russian jet in the mix for their phenomenal intermediate range. It uh, still heaters. is in in the in Seta. A lot of people use uh, SU twenty sevens and whole teams of them. Because yeah. they have a very, very good advantage in both data link and like you know missile variety and speed, they have all the all the good things. What is this did uh, have some some shot in the box ever? I beg your pardon, Ronda. The mountain that's eight point eight four eight km tall. This guy is, is impressive. I'm watching Vistos. Cut there, the entire planet right in half, straight to every. And start zooming out. That's right, Miranda. It, it, it kind of sounds like Miranda. It sounds like you took like a sea sponge and and stuck your microphone in its ass. That's why we love our Miranda. Guys, there's only three reds which worries me slightly. Does anyone know? Yeah, so their disconnect that they had in the first round completely never, like, he completely disconnected with Night, whatever he's going, so we have an advantage. Alright, sadly yeah, for them, it's kind of. Do the, you guys want me to do the full transcript of the number 15 Burger, burger Food King Lettuce? No. <laughs> Definitely not. I'll just do the piece of instead. Alright, let's get that forward. Hey, Mister. They must be hey, well hacked off with them. All of their drugness hey, barely you... registers. They must be well pissed off with their body, right? Uh, yeah, I don't know why they don't have it's a backup. Fair. Yeah, but... I know, it's crazy. Yeah, it's, uh. Yeah. It's weird. Okay. But. Uh, blue's heading north, which is interesting. I'm sure there's some tactic, but uh, they're going in. Reds, oh, they've lost their fancy F-15, so this is going to be a slaughter, I reckon, but we'll see. Different they've, tactic they've from the... a good fight. Different so. tactic from the... Right, missiles out at, and I quote, 50 miles, that's a good effective range, especially for a Mark 60. Look at that baby go. Boom! Looks 
2,600, 2,700, 800, 900, nearly 3,000 knots, 40,000 feet. That's some KE, boys. And that's why they're hard to dodge, because they just blink, blink, and you're dead. And it's also a heavy missile, so it retains its energy sort of better than yeah. the Yeah, it does, it does punch through the air because of that weight. Mm, and it's usually dropping down as well, just because of how it works. Yeah. A really interesting Amram from Bear at 41 miles, okay. God, I would like to see one in a museum, like, you know, real mm. uh, massive. 54. Um, and here's just a case of why the the Phoenix missile is okay, because we make a simple maneuver and it's yeah it loses it's, it it's trash. I wanted to break them up and let them get a bis missile warning. Mm -hmm. Speculative is best. Roger, I mean um, that it's just a fair tactic. I, when I with my measly skills, I teach people don't just fire to kill, fire to posture them as well. If you want them, to, if you don't like how they're flying, mm -hmm. fire, and they'll have to do something because they don't know if that's a dangerous missile or not. The the danger with posture shots is when you go against experienced people. Mm, yep, absolutely. It, it, they know that like you're at forty miles, right? Mm -hmm. And they say, oh, I've got a missile launch. I know I'm fighting F-16, so it's an Amram. So it's a very so I know I'm getting a missile warning, but it's a slow Amram. You mm -hmm. just know that from experience, yep. and so you you also know that you can do a simple maneuver just to change direction, and get go back hot way sooner than if you had a ten mile missile coming at you. We have to be very defensive. More jump, yeah. Uh, Two twenty five Mark sixties, which is a, can be dangerous, uh, popping yes. out over this hill, and in return, bears getting a uh, an Amram out. So we're going to have to see some serious defensive. Yeah, this is a scary. This is scary distance when it comes to finances right here. This is really the sweet spot. Popped it over the mountain. Bear's like, get me out of here! As a three thousand knot missile chases him down. Luckily, they went for Leighton and not Bear? Question mark. Yep. No. Yep. No. Unknown. No ETWS. Them look. Good Tomcat driver. And the boys are just about burnt those missiles. Down, it's going to be closed. Oh, God. I turned on my hacks for this one. And Leighton, ha! Ah, pretty sure that should have hit. I didn't fuse. It should have killed them. Kind of it absolutely up. should have killed them. No, that's yeah. that's no, 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 no. If the F-14, they won't I'll fuse. If, if that go, if the F-14s turned off before it goes pitbull, it doesn't fuse. That's no, it, it pitbulled and it it should have fused right. because it, yeah, it went active. So that when it, once it's active and not receiving information, the fuse is active as well. No, that was Leighton getting uh, the DCS gods decided to spare him. That was lucky. Has someone just disappeared, and if they crash, I'm going to be so angry! Signore, where have you gone? You just crashed into a mountain. Uh, Constant maybe disappointment. We just wanted to, we wanted we to even to, it out. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Yeah. Jesus Christ. They don't even need to bother firing missiles at us. Just let us ignore it, and he'll crash into a valley. Don't go Right. Butter fingers. That's exactly right. Signori has fingers covered in butter. Right, never mind. Let's push on. Squiddle is going down a canyon or something. He's aggressing, as they would like to call it. I gotta go, guys. Have a great night. Bye. Yeah. Thump. Oh, Squiddle's gonna get himself all kinds of trouble if he gets surrounded. Luck. Squirtle doesn't get surrounded. No, Squirtle's, exactly. Squirtle's a genius. Mm, yeah, it's quite. <laughs> this is that F14 is not going to know what hit him as this thing goes pitbull. Oh, that's going to be impossible to dodge from that aspect. Thump! Wow, even blew his fin. No, he didn't. Yes, he did. Look at his Phoenix go scoofy. No, his Phoenix turned. Around. No, he didn't. Sorry. <laughs> I'm being a silly boy. His Phoenix bought a Yui. It's going for a friendly. <laughs> Ah, uh, right. Okay, well that made up for uh, Signore banging, butting his head against a tree. <laughs> okay, look, it's still accelerating. 2,000 knots. 2,001 are so dangerous. Bear! Do something! Do something! Such a deadly missile! Ooh, wow. That just chased him for like 30 miles. 
Yeah. Oh shit, now it's 2v2. I don't like it. I want to be top of the league. I want to be top of the league. Boom. Leighton is ignoring. Going to bring it back. Mr. F16 is like, Squirtle. Whoa. Yeah, that's what I said. You had security on my back. <laughs> he's dead. He got greedy. He got greedy and he's dead. But can Leighton dodge this? Because that is actually a dangerous missile. Oh! 1v1. 1v1. It's tense, isn't it? It's, uh, it's a little bit. It's a little uh, butt clenching. I think that there. Oh, it's, a 30, it's Angel's 30. How did you get. Okay, fine. It's managed to get. Um, guys? Yes, uh, Miranda, can we help you at all? Yes, Pop, we will um, drop can everything do, and help you. Can we do like a challenge? Not really, man. That, that's considered bad form. Bad form. Yeah, that's that. Thank you for the suggestion. I'll put that on my to-do list. Wow, good dodge by him. Look at him. Almost put him up. Boom. Right. Signori's got... Once it's got him cold, it's very hard Jesus for this guy. Christ. Best guy this guy can... Best thing this guy can do is get him mounted to high pine so we can try and surprise Squirtle which way he comes out. But, that said, he's at 650 knots and squirt as that. Oh, 900! Snap! You notice how he stays Portal high. doesn't get surprised. You notice right? how he stays high, because you can go faster up high, and you can uh, keep that energy in the bank. Very hard for this guy to do anything now, except just trying to terrain block. Oops. Wrong button. That's gonna hurt. It's in the fire! Boom! And Signore, uh, just squiddle. Just, boys, by the skin of your teeth, did you get round that? Woo! Okay, guys, you win. Yay! We're joined top of the league table! Super cap. Um, any... Dude, it's still good news, right? I mean, that's, that's... It is good. A win's a win, boys. However you do it, a win's a win. It was, you know, I was, I was talking to the team after this match, and the thing is, is a lot of our deaths are just from really simple, mm -hmm. simple mistakes. And I, I think, like... You know, some minor minor improvement, and you know we will definitely not be done. Well, no, I mean it's it's my job to make you better, so I'm going to charge Signore one hundred dollars every time he dies. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> Let's see if the silly little mistakes still happen when he has well, to do see, that. You see, that can I don't can afford it. We charge him a thousand every time. <laughs> yes, I will. That's funny. <laughs> All right, boys, very well done. Uh, anything yeah. you want to say or whatever before we sign off? Well done to the other team. The improvements yeah, are definitely. showing yeah. greatly. Um, yeah, I'm lucky good. about your disconnect mm -hmm. and missing player, but uh, and GR competitive guys, well done. No, I'm yeah. Proud of you. Okay. And we uh, and uh, I'm proud to proud to say you know we are currently undefeated. And it uh, is true. And oh, the other of, thing yeah. is. Sorry, Squirtle is the leading yeah. killer in Satal. What the hell? He Tell so far the lead, he's been the leader right. since the beginning. How? And I haven't even updated the website yet with the latest. He's like 16 and 1, basically. But he's got a tiny little brain, though. How could that happen? <laughs> <laughs> I know. I know. <laughs> <laughs> No, no, he's, he's, a, he's so a genius. Dumb. He's a genius. All right, boys. Well, oh, I'm, I don't know about that. I'm just well. doing you. I'm just doing you. He makes it back okay, I'm guessing. Yeah. Oh, I go up yeah, to 62,000 feet. It's actually really nice. <laughs> Right. I, I had a lot of extra gas, so I figured I might as well go see the moon for a second. And Very good. Down. All right, guys, it's super late for me, so I've got to go. Well done, and I'll see you tomorrow or whenever. All, All right, right. Have a good night. Have a nice day.